Hello everybody, welcome back to Polycore Media. I am X Logos Killer and today I am going to be showcasing uh or I'm just talking about the new DLC character Itachi, the animation version, and the powers which he brings to the game. Or due to it even. Uh, and I do understand I'm a bit late to this. Uh, I was on holiday or vacation as Americans call it, and when I came back I had like a day break or two days break of not doing anything. So, first of all, Itachi. One of my favourite characters. Love him. Sexy bastard. And honestly, he's like a, he's like a, he's like the Professor Snape of Naruto. His powers, his jutsus even. First of all, Sukuyomi. Sukuyomi effectively is uh, it's hard to do, but it's annoying. Um, it's very accurate. It, it, it works like the Kamui uh, secret technique. You get from Kakashi, has to be very accurate on the dot. But it has a very short 15 seconds recharge time. I guess that's pretty, pretty average actually. Um, but effectively, what it is is it's like the scene that Itachi did from back in OG Naruto, you know, come on the crucifix, the cross, and just shanked him a bunch of times with swords. Basically, that. Bonus is when he's in that state of getting stabbed up by the sword, you can still punch him. But they still, but the balance act about it is that when you're able to hit him when he's getting stabbed up by the swords, they take reduced damage. They don't take full damage. So there is a bit of nerf there. But he's actually good balancing. I like that. The second jutsu, we have the Yasaka beads, which I'm not sure where these come from. I think these, I think some of these come from these originate. I'm not sure where these originate. I've never, I've never seen him do this. But anywho, I like it. And you use it, you can't be touched, even by ultimates, you can't be touched. It's like a fucking shield texture. And the beads do a lot of damage, and they track. And they track good. And 22 seconds recharge time, I would say so. <laughs> it's a bit of a cheese. Um, but it is great, and it has a big blast radius, and I love it. It made me want to play Medic a lot more, having the Yasaka beads as an option. I love them. Coming with Itachi is a new Shadow Clone Explosion. To put it simply, it's just like a shadow, it's like a mixture of the multi Shadow Clone Jutsu, where you summon a clone that goes towards the enemy. And it's a, also a blend of Daedara's Clay Clone, which explodes. You, know, you activate it, you go towards the enemy and it explodes. Uh, very long recharge time, like the multi Shadow Clone Jutsu, 40 seconds. Um, but I guess for what you're getting, it's very good because the blast radius is also pretty wham. Last but not least is the secret technique. Now this one took me a while to figure out. I hated this. So it's a Genjutsu, which put, it, it, it explains the element of pitch things. The Genjutsu puts it in infinite loop of intervals. Now at intervals, it resets enemies' beneficial effects, the current position, and it also gets rid of the allies' harmful effects. Now when you first activate it, I believe it also it doesn't tell you this. It also resets your jutsus. And then when it and then when it's when once the isn't on the effects run out, and you are then able to activate the second jutsu, the second part of the jutsu, you then also reset your things again. So you could use the Asaka beads like three times in like two minutes. Um, an additional command restraint. The, the additional command. Which I don't actually. I've not been hit with this. I mean, I don't know. I, I don't really. I don't really think much of a difference with this new command. The new command restrains enemies. The revives allies until now the seal in the use of jutsu is now. I figured that out the hard way because I did it and I couldn't use my powers and I was like, what is going on? Um, so I, I felt the effects, positive and negative, are uh, two to the enemy and myself of the first part of the is an army, but I've not actually felt the effects towards me or towards the enemy of the um, of you know the second part of the is an army. Um, overall, I think the new jutsu that have come uh, is a Nami, it's okay. Uh, Sukuyomi is decent, I like it. It's actually, I, I don't mind, it's pretty good actually. But I think the winner of what, and yeah, the, the new, the new um, clone jutsu is pretty good, substitution. I think the winner, the winning part of the new Itachi DLC character is the Yasaka beads. The Yasaka beads are brilliant and. I really do want to play Medic a lot more now, just because of them beads. 
Um, then of course with Hitachi comes all the special like you know things you can unlock like his hair and his outfit and whatnot. And plus then the special event uh, things you can unlock, which I have unlocked the sword. And the sword when you fight with Itachi's sword from the unlocks of the new event, uh, it has the black uh, crow feathers. So um, very nice touch. Anyway, I have been. This is my first ever time doing one of these, so I'm not sure how well I did. If I did shit, or if I did good, I don't know. Let me know. I have been Exlogs Killer. Please like, comment, subscribe. Link in my Discord. Peace. Love you all. Have a good day.